You know, it's only as strong as the number of members it has and the amount of money in its coffers. And so to maintain the bodies and the dollars, it's got to exert control. And that's where the game comes in, just like a pimp controls a prostitute. You know, when a pimp is bringing a prostitute into the game, he doesn't announce it. The first thing he does is, you know, if she's a runaway in a bus station. He's going to buy her lunch. Tell her how pretty she is. Take her to the boutique in the station and buy her a dress and act like he's the best thing she's ever met. And she's so smitten by the time she realizes what she's signing up for. You know, he has awakened some feelings in her that she's never had before. She's never felt that appreciated and valued. Mm-hmm. That she's, when she, it comes time to sell her body, she's like, I don't want to lose this feeling. And so the same goes with the church. When you join the church, what's the first thing they do? They love bomb you. <laughs> you know, and that's really toxic. <laughs> and we don't like to talk about it. And in sociology, you know, there's a cycle of a 